The 7 train is apparently a popular line for subway surfing because of the city views that can be captured for social media. But teenagers should remember that participating in these dangerous trends can have dangerous consequences. Now, police say this happened at around 5.30 yesterday when the 14-year-old boy fell onto the tracks. His body was removed from the tracks between the 33rd Street Station and Queens Plaza Station. He suffered from head trauma and was taken to Cohen Children's Hospital, where he was pronounced dead. And just last week, another subway surfing incident ended terribly in Brooklyn. Police say two 14-year-old boys jumped onto the L train at Broadway Junction Station, and one was killed when entering the next stop at Bushwick Aberdeen as it entered the tunnel. The other was seriously injured. The MTA chief of transit recently addressed the spike in subway surfing. Subway surfing is deadly. The attention and the clout that these kids seek is just not worth it. All too often, we are seeing young kids 12, 13, and 14 years old, not thinking of the tragic consequences of their actions. And last week, the mayor pointed fingers at social media companies for these videos circling on the internet, and he calls for a ban. Reporting in Long Island City, Michelle Ross, Pix 11 News. All right.